If you're renting a home or apartment in Central Florida, you've probably noticed it. The monthly cost is exploding. Orlando is one of the top three cities with the biggest spike. Experts say there may be no end in sight. Fox 35's Lydia Hugh has the details. The nationwide surge on rent prices is forcing renters to dig deeper into their pockets to help them find or maintain housing as the federal moratorium on evictions has now ended. The median rent price across the country has risen by more than 19% over a year ago to reach $1,789. But there are some cities, particularly in the Sunbelt region, that are seeing spikes that are much higher. Take a look at the median rent in Phoenix, Arizona, up more than 27%. Las Vegas, Orlando, and Tampa also landing in the top 10 markets for steepest increases. But it's Miami that comes out on top with more than a 50% year over year increase. According to Realtor.com, this increase in rent means that people are spending more on housing. In Miami, 59% of a household's income is now spent on rent. It's more than 40% here in New York City. Economists say that these increases in rent prices will continue to drive inflation. And what is happening now is that uh, people are essentially saying, well, jobs have been created. Uh, maybe I want to move out of parents' basement. At the same time, people who wanted to buy, now the prices are so high, they are renewing their rental leases. Consequently, the rental demand, very, very strong. Some people priced out of buying a, uh, buying a home, also young adults moving out of the basement. The causes here are a nationwide shortage on housing and a rental inventory that is at a 38-year low. Looking through the rest of the year, rent prices are expected to continue to rise. Reporting from New York City, Lydia Hu for Fox Business.